Here at General Conference, what I am looking forward to uh, the most is, um, I would say, having all of delegates from all over the world, 800 plus, 864 I think is the correct number, of having delegates from all over the, the world. Um, the thing that's always very really unique about it is that sometimes we only look at delegations as our annual conferences, but to come here um, to Portland and to see our brothers and sisters that are in Africa and Asia is, uh, is, is very unique and is very special that I think about the United Methodist Connection. My schedule this week uh, is just like with everybody, very busy, uh, but I have the wonderful opportunity tonight to be a facilitator for COSRO. Uh, COSRO asked me to be a facilitator in which tonight all women, it's called the COSRO Women's Briefing, all women from again all over the world will come together tonight. There will be a, an agenda, a program, a time of prayer and praise. And then there's going to be an opportunity where I am um, part of the Faith and Order. Faith and Order is my legislative committee. And so I will be leading a discussion with women who are assigned to the Faith and Order Legislative Committee. What we will be looking at is how to be very strategic in helping women um, become chairs and vice chairs or even secretaries to uh, step up to the plate and uh, to be leaders in the faith and order. Also, we will be leading a discussion of legislation that will be primarily an interest to women and children. There's also gonna be an opportunity that within the briefing that the United Methodist women are gonna share their legislation. So what is wonderful for me is that I get an opportunity once again, not only to be with women across the globe, but I will specifically be with women who will be assigned to Faith and Order. Some of the women I know, um, and then some I do not know. So that will be fascinating. Uh, my legislative committee is Faith and Order. Uh, very blessed, I, in 2012, I was also on this legislative committee. Basically what faith and order is, what they say, faith and order, uh, dealing with uh, the doctrinal um, of the church, also dealing with ordering the life of the church. Uh, we will also deal with some legislation that will deal with the whole human sexuality um, issue, as well as ordination. So it's a, kind of a, a broad uh, committee, but faith and order deals with the discipline and ordering the life of the church. Once again, being a delegate from North Georgia, uh, we have a lot of resources that come through North Georgia. We have had the wonderful opportunity to have several of the general secretaries, uh, like Dr. Kim Kate, uh, like Dr. Uh, excuse me, Dr. Kim Kate, um, as well as uh, Barbara Boschagrain. And so we have been blessed to bring the actual general secretaries of those agencies to come and speak with our uh, delegation. Uh, I'm inspired by them for what they do. Um, they are general secretaries, and uh, so they helped our delegation understand more about the legislative committees, I mean about the legislative process. Um, they helped us with the legislation specific for their general agency, and uh, so it was a joy getting to see uh, them again.